All right, Cancer. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna do something unique here today with your love reading, okay? And you'll see why. You'll see why. But let's go ahead and start here and dive in right away so we don't waste any time. All right, Cancer. If you're seeing a Capricorn, Cancer, if you are seeing a Capricorn, uh, they're too mature right now, too childish, too dramatic, too like, uh, you know, like, it's my sword, not your sword, give it back. You know, like, na 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 na. Maybe they just, I don't think it's gonna work out. They just, they have a lot to learn here still uh, in regards to who you are, the relationship. It's just, you know, you know what you want. I just feel that they're treating the relationship like a little bit immature, okay? Aquarius now, Aquarius. If you're seeing Aquarius, okay, Cancer? If you're seeing Aquarius, they definitely want to nurture the relationship, take care of you, you know, um, they, they care about you a lot. Uh, for some, they might want to even um, see a future with you as a family with the baby here, you know, they're, you know. So that's what Aquarius is thinking right now. Um, in a committed level, high committed, you know, um, yeah. All right, they, they, they do love you. They care about you a lot. Uh, for some, um, they might want to try to get you pregnant or maybe you, you know, or they might want to get pregnant. <laughs> so uh, careful if you're not trying for that, but if you are, congratulations, <laughs> okay? All right, if you're seeing a Pisces, if you're seeing a Pisces, oh, they definitely want to settle down with you. They want to marry you. They have no eyes for, the, for others. They have eyes only for you and... Even though they hold their emotions back uh, sometimes, but they do have a lot of emotions for you inside, okay? All right. If you're seeing Aries, if you're seeing Aries, if you're seeing Aries, oh, if you're seeing Aries, it's not gonna work, it's not working, and it's kind of sad here, you know? You see that? This person here said it's not working out. They feel like they probably have to leave, or somebody here has to leave. Uh, yeah. So, yeah, it actually, you know, might not work out, so. And they kind of know that. If you're seeing a Taurus, if you're seeing a Taurus, they want to marry you, okay? Um, they see you as the marriage, marriage type. They see you as a wife, as a husband, to be. <laughs> and if you're married, they definitely want to stay married. They don't want to leave, okay? Um... They definitely want to settle down with you. They love you, love you very much. They feel you're it. You're the one. You might get a proposal this Christmas. <laughs> All right. Um, okay. So, if you're seeing a Gemini, if you're seeing a Gemini, answer. If you're seeing a Gemini. It's, if you're seeing a Gemini, uh, there might be a third party situation there going on. Uh, they might be seeing other people right now. Um, there's a heartbreak there going on. If it's not seeing other, other people, it's not gonna, it's not gonna, there's gonna be a breakup with this one, okay? Whew, there's definitely a, yeah. Sorry. All right. Cancer, if you're seeing a Cancer, if your Cancer is seeing a Cancer. Oh, if Cancer is seeing a Cancer, it's possible that they get, they're still looking out there, all right? It's possible that they don't think that you're the one. And they're still looking out there in the horizon, into the world, you know? Um, yeah, for some, it could be that they, they're seeing more, you know, two people or for others, just that they're still have their eyes open out there for other people, you know, looking. All right, Cancer, if you're seeing a Leo, if you're seeing a Leo, if you're seeing a Leo, oh, they want to be with you. They want to make this relationship a successful one. They want to settle down. They want to brag about you to their family and friends, to the world. You know, they see you as the one. Okay? They do. They do. They do. They want to make this like a victorious, you know, victorious kind of relationship. All right, if you're seeing a Virgo, if you're seeing a Virgo, Cancer. If you're seeing a Virgo, uh, 
I think that they're, they're, they, they might just, you know, not be taking this relationship too serious, you know. Um, they think about you a lot, and but I don't think they're willing to put some action into it as the way you would like them to be, okay? Uh, I think just like as they come fast into your life like that, they can also leave very fast, okay? They want to... Yeah, yeah, they're just not ready yet. They're not ready. They're going with the flow. They're going with the flow. Okay, if you're seeing a Libra, if you're seeing a Libra, they're confused right now. They don't know what they want. They don't know who they want, what they want, if they should stay or if they should go. They're just confused. So this is probably not gonna last. If you're seeing a Scorpio, if you're seeing a Scorpio, if you're seeing a Scorpio, ooh, falling here if you've seen a scorpio they just want to you know have some fun you know be playful nothing serious they don't want to commit you know commit just yet they want to you know go out there party have a good time maybe date around some more you know so they're just yeah and if you've seen a sagittarius if you've seen a sag if you've seen a sag they're just focused on uh, you know uh finances right now they don't have time for love they're not focused on love they're not going to give you the kind of love that you want them to give because they're too their heads are too in finances and business and all the things that's going on in their life right now they don't have time for love okay all right guys thank you so much cancer share like and subscribe to next time love you all namaste